Hey guys, it's me again. I'm going to do another LEGO Technic set review. And this is the LEGO Technic Power Functions 6x6 All-Terrain Tow Truck. As I put this box over, this one is a 40th anniversary set. It also builds a Explorer vehicle. There are 1,862 pieces in this set. The set also comes with SL Servo, Medium Servo, Receiver, Battery Box, Controller. And this is the first set that LEGO has attempted to make everything remote control. It has got a sophisticated gearbox. And this blue that you see is a score to it as well. The manual is a binder book with 402 pages. A bunch of parts continue over from the Mercedes Benz Aerox 3245. So let's get this set going. I'm going to actually put down the box and use a divider tray to balance the set on. As a matter of fact, I might use but that way you can see it a little bit better. So let me pick it up. Oh no, don't tell me the bones are. So here we are. It looks like one of the booms is loose. That's normal. So right off the bat, this is a brand new color blue that LEGO has never used until now. This set is $289 with 1,862 pieces. And here we go. I'm going to actually flip the battery box on and show you that this thing is completely remote control. And one thing is right off the bat is you can put it in gear mode and if you have children and you don't want them to move it, you can put it in gear mode and it goes back, forth, right, left. And on each side you have a bunch of you had to select up gearing. So now I'm going to either extend the booms or turn the winch, turn the crane on. So it goes about that far and then it goes back around about that far. And right now I'm lowering and raising the winch. And here goes the booms. I'm going to actually show you how far they go down. That's how far they go down. And then they go right back up. As you can see, I'm controlling all of it just from one controller. And then the final one is this crane arm. It goes about that high, if you're wondering. I'm going to let this test in or um, linear actuator stand. And now I'm going to let it go back down. As you can see, I'm doing all from remote control. There's no gimmicks. And now I'm going to turn the set off. That way, it doesn't accidentally drive off the uh, divider tray. And I'm going to put the divider tray and the manual in the floor. And show you some exclusive 
details that are exclusive to the set. Right off the bat, uh, one thing you noticed is the boom arms and the extensions both are from the Mercedes-Benz Aerox set. These little black pieces, you see one, two, three, four, five, six. They're from the Porsche 911 GT3 RS. There are chains on here as well. Four chains total. On the front of the set, there is a 30th, 40th anniversary plaque. Got my finger on it, I think. Yep. And reappearing from other sets, there is a miniature teddy bear. Now, as I'm holding it right now, it's pretty well balanced. And then the next thing, final thing, free suspended rear end axles. It's pretty cool. And if you want to and Let's say if your little kid is playing with it and you don't want him to you just want him to roll it back and forth, it completely rolls back and forth as ease. And that's about it. Um, there's two doors. There's the final two things. There's a door on the left and a door on the right. The mirrors are making a return from the Mercedes Benz Aerox 3245 and this exclusive four cylinder inline engine. And as you can see, when I move the tires, the pistons go up and down like the real engine. That's one of the key features of LEGO. And I'm going to show you what it looks like underneath. And I'm going to quickly grab hold of the tires and take my hands out of the way. And as you can see, this thing is pretty sophisticated. It has a huge gearbox assembly, it goes from the front all the way to the back. And this is my review of the Lego Technic 6 by 6 all-terrain tow truck. And just to let you know, this one's still available at the Lego store.